Hello, it's Laura here from Skyblazing with Frost and Warmer. Yesterday I held a launch party for my business. It was very successful, but I did learn one big lesson and I thought I'd share it with you today. So, banners are a great thing to have for your networking event and I had one that we'd ordered back in December. Kept it in the box and been meaning to have a little look at it. Hadn't quite got around to opening it, so yesterday about half an hour before my launch party started, I got it out, got it all ready to start, pulled it out, and was quite surprised <laughs> to see that it was pink, and it was advertising a weight watching business, which isn't quite what we're aiming for in Pride Road, more kind of the opposite in terms of making things bigger, I'll do. So, couldn't put that up, so I had to go without a banner. So we've since told the company and now here is my pride road architect for your home deserves amazing banner Mom, oh what they were brilliant networking event yeah. so they've done it very well and brought it back the day after day after the event though so when i next host an event which will hope to be in a month or so i'll have it ready but moral of the story get it out a week before <laughs> and check it if not in the month before when you've got it in your office yeah. So whilst we're here, Laura, we're actually in your house. Do you want to show us? I'm I'm going to just uh, scan around the room yeah. with the camera, pan around the room. So this is our living room, which is all uh, newly built and added onto the existing uh, three bed semi detached. It's it looks oak framed. It's actually one year old dried oak framed the mm. roof, and then this is our new living room, and it has a mezzanine level above it so we've got a double height space at the edge is it tidy if i go upstairs uh, possibly <laughs> shall i go up so the stairs oh, that's the door back into the kitchen so that's laura's family ah and we have music in the background okay and then these are the stairs just going up Oh, <laughs> the real life of... So, so this is a story and a half high. Oops! <laughs> did, did you trip over anything? <laughs> Hold um, on. It goes up into the apex and that's, I, um, that's when I got planned in the car. <laughs> Sorry, we just moved you away things. <laughs> It's, it's a great lovely. space, it was a guest bedroom to start with and now that, now that the amount of children has expanded this is our room and then we've got this big picture window, it faces northeast, but floods the light down yeah. into the living room below. Do you put your blind down? Yeah, but it's not a blackout blind so it doesn't make a huge difference. Right, okay. I actually wanted two Velux windows but the planners wouldn't let me so I've just got one mm, at the back. Yeah, but it is... It's got a great height to it, a lovely feel to it. And it's separated from the house as well, so. Yeah. I'm just going to go back down the stairs. I'll follow you down. Do, 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 do. <laughs> and then you can shut off the house. Okay. 